In today's video, we'll see some Christmas traditions in the UK and how these traditions have evolved through the centuries. The first thing we'll see is the word Christmas. In the past, people would call it Yule, which means midwinter in Old Saxon. To understand why people celebrated midwinter, we have to think of a world in complete darkness. People had no electricity in the past, and winters used to be darker. Can you imagine London looking like this at Christmas time? I bet you can't. In the past, people used to welcome the winter solstice with festive celebrations, because the rebirth of light was very important. The word Christmas was used in the 11th century for the first time, with the advent of Christianity, because they celebrated the birth of Jesus in the winter solstice too. Number 2. White Christmas Many people have the stereotype of White Christmas, but, to be honest, it hardly ever snows in London at Christmas time. And it didn't used to snow in the past either, according to weather records. If you want a White Christmas, you'll have to travel to the north. It often snows in Scotland at Christmas. Number 3. Decorations According to the Venerable Bede, a monk living in the 8th century, People would pick twigs from the yew tree to celebrate Christmas, the advent of light. And they used to hang the mistletoe in their homes. Nowadays, the British hardly ever put showy decorations outside their homes. They almost always hang evergreens, ivy, holly. People kiss under the mistletoe, like they used to in the past. It's a very popular tradition. Another interesting thing is people hardly ever leave the Christmas decorations up after Twelfth Night, which falls on the 5th of January, because they say it's very unlucky. Number 4. Food. Mince pies are very popular at Christmas time, but they're very different from the past. They used to be made with meat and dried fruits in the Middle Ages. Nowadays, however, they're almost always filled with dried fruits, spices and spirits. The Christmas pudding is another typical food at Christmas time. It is always served hot. And it usually has a silver coin inside. Whoever finds it will be very lucky the following year. But the Christmas pudding hasn't always looked like this. In the Middle Ages, it used to look like a porridge. Number 5. Carol singing. The British are very musical, and people often go carol singing these days. In the past, they often went war sailing, which is the Saxon word for it. War sailing means going from door to door, singing songs, sending blessings to the people, and sometimes asking for treats. People keep war sailing in many places in the UK, like in the south of Wales, with the Mary Lloyd tradition. A very, very ancient one. Number 6. Christmas cards. People didn't use to send Christmas cards before the 19th century. The first Christmas cards used to be humorous. Many would denounce inequality in society. Nowadays, despite new technologies and the social media, most families very often send Christmas cards to other people and cards hardly ever show Christian pictures. Number 7. Father Christmas Father Christmas used to visit people's houses in the past. He used to wear a green robe. Nowadays, he sometimes borrows red clothes from his cousin, Santa Claus, and they often help each other deliver presents to the children of the world. Kids usually leave food and drink for Father Christmas, Santa and Rudolf. Number 8. Boxing Day In the past, Boxing Day was the day when the rich would gift servants with money or food. Nowadays, Boxing Day, which falls on the 26th of December, is a national holiday or bank holiday in the UK. Trains never run on that day, and people usually go shopping like mad. Many others attend sporting events, especially football. Number 9. Pantomimes Pantomimes are as old as time. The Romans used to hold festive events 
around the winter solstice. Men would disguise as women, and women would as men. Tradition continues these days, and families often go to watch pantos. The stories are always simple and very funny, full of slapstick and music. I hope you enjoyed this video. I wish you a very Merry Christmas and a very Happy New Year. Thanks for watching.